Many experts believe that people with diabetes should eat fewer carbohydrates. It is very confusing to know how much of carbohydrates you need to eat when you have type 2 diabetes. In this video, I am going to clear the confusion and also talk to you about the good carbohydrates, bad carbohydrates, the effects of fiber on your blood sugars, and how carbohydrate counting will affect your blood sugar levels. Hello, I am Rajita Bamakanti, registered nurse, faith-based holistic coach, and founder of Healthy You Lifestyle Center. If you want to develop healthy habits for life, one step at a time, then click the red subscribe button and the bell icon right now. Type 2 diabetes is more common. It accounts for over 90% of the diagnosis. In this type of diabetes, your pancreas is either not producing enough insulin or the insulin that's produced is resistant to the cells in your body. Therefore, it leaves too much blood sugar in your bloodstream. There are many factors that affects the blood sugars in your body, like exercise, your stress, any illness, and food. Food is the biggest component that affects your blood sugars. In the food, there are three macronutrients proteins, fat, and carbohydrates. Carbohydrates have the biggest effect on your blood sugars. Whole plant-based foods such as fruits, vegetables, grains, and legumes are unprocessed whole natural foods that, have, that are high in fiber and protein. So they slow the digestion of the carbohydrates in your body and keep your blood sugars more controlled and stable. It avoids the spike of the blood sugars and followed by a crash like a roller coaster in your bloodstream. What foods that you eat on a daily basis have carbohydrates? Tell me in the comment section below and continue watching this video until the end to learn about good carbohydrates, bad carbohydrates, and how carbohydrate counting can affect your blood sugars. And also the free download at the end of the video. Complex carbohydrates such as brown rice, whole wheat, oatmeal, lentils, and grains, fruits and vegetables. These are all unprocessed foods that are high in fiber that keeps your blood sugars more in control, keeps your food digestion slower so that the blood sugars are controlled and it is recommended to eat these type of carbohydrates for type 2 diabetes versus processed foods such as sugars, pastries, cookies, white flour. These are the foods that rise your blood sugars very fast and they are not recommended to eat. These are called bad carbs, essentially. Carbohydrate counting. How does carbohydrate counting help your blood sugars? Carbohydrate counting helps keep your blood sugars close to normal. When your blood sugars are close to normal, then you are more energetic, feel better, and you avoid diabetes complications. In order to know about the target of your blood sugar, you need to consult with your physician. It is a balance 
between your physical activity, your foods that you eat, to keep your blood sugars under targets. In order to learn about how to count your um, carbohydrates, you need to consult with your dietitian or a diabetic educator who will help you teach how to count carbohydrates and what foods to eat, what time to eat in order to keep your blood sugars balanced. Download my free What I Can Eat to learn about food choices that have carbohydrates and the foods that have little to no carbohydrates. The link for the free download is in the description box below. I am your faith-based holistic coach. Until next time, choose the right option.